hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel for those of you who don't know me my name is naninga uh, welcome to this channel but most importantly you guys need to know that i have a jumia haul yes again Yes, because I love Jumia that much. So I did get a bunch of beauty products because that's what I normally mostly shop on Jumia. And the reason I got a bunch of beauty products, you guys know the way I'm a chipstick somehow because I like a good diet. I like uh, a deal, a good deal. And Jumia was actually having a brand day sale and the brand in question was actually Maybelline. And you know how much I love Maybelline products because they are very good quality and very affordable in price at the same time so i did decide to purchase a bunch of items off the jumia website and i also do have a bunch of stuff from the good life pharmacy and uh i decided to combine this um products because they are all beauty products and the good life products were not so many so there was no point of making a video for them by them other than that i honestly hope that you are doing well wherever you are whoever you are wherever you're watching from i just hope you're really doing well i am doing great on the other hand and i am grateful for that i also hope that you're having a blessed life like but let's continue the products came in a box and i am glad they actually came in a box like it's a nor box so it's obviously recycled i actually prefer this to like the paper bags that they normally come in because i feel like those paper bags are just not good for the environment and they're just not necessary if there are such boxes but anyway i'm so glad it did actually come in this box and the first thing that i got i'm just going to hurry up this video because nowadays i do not like talking so much so the first thing that i got is actually this even and matte garnier yes i'm trying to pronounce it the way i normally hear it being pronounced in the ad and uh as a matter of fact, I bought this product because of ads. Like, I was bombarded with ads on this product. Like, from uh, from every corner, every social media, in Instagram, Facebook, you know, YouTube. Like, this ad, this ad bombarded me. Like, they, they really marketed it, guys. I don't know if it's the one, but it, I believe it's the one. So, it's the anti dark Mark Serum by Garnier and it's the skin active and it's the new even and matte vitamin c high concentration booster serum visible more even skin in three days now those of you who've been following me you guys know that i have dark spots okay the skin is looking pretty flawless right now but it's because of foundation and powder and all that so i don't have any active pimples but the spots i have spots guys i have I look like a leopard like if i remove this i look like a leopard and you guys know that i tried uh using so many anti dark max products i've used them i've used them guys i've used them so i was very excited actually when um social media decided to bombard me with ads of this new product and you guys know that i love a good garnier product like they're three in one i, I love it. vitamin c product let me just be honest with you guys and i'm very excited to try this out let me just read because you guys are here for the whole you're not here for this specific product let me just read what it's supposed to do hurriedly just in case you have not heard about it it says that um it's the new garnier even and matte vitamin c glowing serum so it's gonna make your skin glow i'm assuming so direction for use is just spread on your face and then there's a caution for sun alert i'm assuming because it's a vitamin c product and uh it just says that on the first use your skin is smoother more radiant and matte who doesn't want a matte face as you can see i'm already like shiny here here yeah who doesn't want a matte face and i just done this makeup like a few minutes ago and you then can it also says that in three days your skin is visibly more even i'm telling you these companies the promises they are making are insane three days like it's no longer one week one month or continued use <laughs> remember products a long time ago used to be written with continued use in case you're hearing screams i have children playing around with my son so they're just playing games three days people three days i thought other companies were ambitious this is even more ambitious in three days <laughs> your skin is visibly more even visibly you know when they say visibly it means like people will notice yeah so let's see let's see about this product i'm very excited to get it 
I have not opened inside because I don't want this to be a really long video, but let's just open it. Oh, oh, I, oh, oh, I love this. I love this so much. It comes in a dropper and it's glass. This is glass, as you can see. Yeah, I love it. Very simple. Yeah, and tiny. How many ml is this? 30 ml. I guess that's just standard sort of. Most serums are like 50 ml. 30 yeah they're usually 30 but it's just a dropper i love this i love this i can't wait to use it and i will come back with the review for this product so look out then that. we have uh now for the maybelline oh oh this was also from like the l'oreal store so i'm assuming i don't know they are connected but uh this is maybelline products now they are tightly wrapped mm. Super stay full coverage under eye concealer in the shade honey. Now products were marked down and I told you guys I love buying beauty products when they are marked down. Like just go on the Jumia website time when there's a brand sale either for the brand that you want or when there's an overall Jumia sale or maybe when there's a, you know, seasonal sales like Christmas sales and all that. That's when I buy my beauty products. So I got this, yeah, super stay full coverage under eye concealer in honey. Now I've been using another um, Maybelline concealer if you've been watching my videos and it's another type. It's not this tube like type fit me concealer i believe that uh the fit me range is not as superior to the super stay range because i normally see like the super stay uh what is it called the super stay foundations are supposed to be a bit slightly superior to the fit me foundations but i'm not sure about that so i was using this maybelline fit me it was in the shade caramel number 40 and i decided to get the super stay full coverage under eye concealer in the shade honey it does look really light though but let me just swatch both of them so that i can see whether this is actually my shade in case you're my skin tone you can actually know also what kind of shade to get so uh this is the super stay it's 6 ml this other one was how many mls this other one was 88 ml 8.8 .8. yes I was shocked. I was like, this is 6 ml and then this is 88 ml. Like, the discrepancy was going to be too large. But this was 8.8 .8 ml and this is 6 ml. So let me just swatch this new one. Ah, it does look like it could be for my skin. It is actually for my skin tone. Oh, dear. It is so dear. It is so light. But let me just compare it so that I can see whether, you know, if you go a few shades lighter on uh, concealer, it's not that bad okay they are almost similar because this is the super stay it's just slightly dark this super stay is just slightly dark and this is the no this is the fit me sorry so this is the fit me the one the old one that i was using and then this one is the new one that i'm i've bought which is the super stay in the shade honey so this is honey this is caramel so they are almost similar but the caramel is slightly darker and the honey is lighter so honey is lighter caramel is slightly darker yeah so that is the ones that i got i'm pretty excited to try this out yeah i had not bought a, a, a concealer as you guys know i've used this concealer for the longest time as you can see it's even patchy inside the packaging like this uh this shows like it's basically over but uh an eyeliner and actually this eyeliner i already have it quite disappointed i actually thought it was a different one from the one i got when i was ordering because it had been marked down so drastically i believe i got it at about 300 kenya shillings and previously it was about 800 shillings if i'm not wrong or yeah between 600 800 shillings and it was marked down to 300 shillings so i got this colossal kajal argan oil uh pencil in black it's the one that i normally use in my videos it's a crayon eyeliner and uh i wanted actually a liquid liner but i never managed to get i they used to have liquid liners on their maybelline liquid liners on their website but they no longer bring so this one is just the one i normally use it looks like this very simple it's the colossal kajar argan oil in black and 
when i just swatch so as you it, can see it's very very black but i actually wanted a liquid one not a crayon one but this one is crayon in case you're interested in a crayon eyeliner as you can see it's the one i've lined my waterline with it does a really good job for lining the waterline i love it i actually love it it's just that i already had one and i wanted like a different one i thought it was a different one i was purchasing but it's really good like it's good for a crayon liner it is really really good next we have this uh what is it called a skin primer it's a hydrating primer let me open it first so as i was saying basically it is a primer for the face and the one i've been using is the maybelline fit me matte and poreless normal to oily skin and this one is the mattifying primer this is the one i've been using it's a mattifying primer that's the one i've used to recreate this makeup look so um uh it says it has a clay base so i decided to get the other one which is purple in color and it is the maybelline fit me luminous and smooth this other one was not luminous and smooth this one was matte and poreless this one is luminous and smooth hydrating primer yeah normal to dry skin so this one is for normal to dry skin and it's a hydrating primer and it's just luminous smooth and this one has spf 20 so i'm pretty excited even this one had spf 20 there pretty much the same size so this is the one i got and uh like maybe i should just try and tell you like the consistency so that you guys can see so this one is it's just popped up a lot because i think I, I had squeezed the bottle so much but it's oh this one is really soft like a moisturizer or like a lotion feels like a lotion but this one is usually slightly thicker yeah does it also have a clay base no this one this one is not written clay base like the other one so it doesn't have clay in it this hydrating primer doesn't have clay in it but this one has clay in it yes just in case you're interested in that and the price as usual i'll be showing you the price and i'll also hopefully be linking the products in the description box below but basically all the prices had been marked down drastically like when i was purchasing them drastically okay i believe that those those are the maybelline products that i got um and a garnier product but i do have one product that i also picked from jumia that i think deserves a mention and because this product is like in case you haven't discovered them i suggest that you discover them from this perfume. perfume now these are not original perfumes but they are really good dupes like really really good and they are from france and they are they adopt perfumes like i bought this from the linton's beauty world store yes So for you guys who cannot actually afford like real original designer perfumes, I highly, highly suggest this. And I only bought one. Yeah. From this order, I only bought one, which is the Lady Glitter. And I believe it's a dupe for life. This is called Lady Glitter. And as you can see, the bottle looks like that. And the reason I had to tell you guys, like if you haven't discovered them and you can't afford like original designer bottles of perfume, please just try this this brand it's called adopt it's a brand called adopt is it adopt yeah it's adopt and it's like springle springle spring roll you see spring roll in the tuna rudisha spring roll uko kwa free gender weka uko so it's a french brand as i was saying it's a french brand and they make like designer dupes tight tight budget like 1000 2000 and you don't want like really fake perfumes like that are horrible and quickly nini nini advising you guys there are so many like there are so many they're like over 10 uh dupes of brands and it's a french company so you know the french know their perfumes yeah so it's a french company and it is like for example this is red dress which is a dupe for this is it called c armani or yeah i believe it's c armani and it smells really good <sighs> so good and this one is marche i don't like marche so much 
but still smells amazing like still passes but not like red and dress with for... whatever your preference is right and then we have this lady glitter which mm, let's test it <laughs> Woo! oh god it is so familiar smells like my mom but oh it smells so good yeah so basically try this scent it is they are dope they are dope oh, oh, oh. i really like perfumes i know you guys can't smell. i know you guys can't smell them but like they smell amazing okay so um basically it is they are all good like just test them out you can even google adopt perfumes in case you're interested in them you'll get all about them and then and now for the good life stuff i told you guys i have stuff from good life pharmacy and i'm not gonna disappoint with good life because i've been shopping on good life for a really long time in case i don't find something on jumia i normally go to good life and yeah we are so lucky actually kitale has a good life so i'm glad they came they haven't stayed for so long by the they've stayed but about shopping from there good life has a pharmacy in kitale so i'm so happy about that and i picked up three things only okay three beauty products the other products are not beauty products i normally pick up like nutritional supplements from there so we have three things and the first one i got is this vaseline lip balm lip therapy because our masks are off <laughs> Uh, masks are off let's just hope because i saw something was i hallucinating or i saw something like china in lockdown again on the internet or something of the sort i don't know when this video will go up but like i saw something crazy like that like china goes into lockdown again lord have mercy yeah so basically um this vaseline lip therapy is aloe this is the aloe one i picked it up i already opened the like little wrapper that it came with because i was so curious and it just says suits dried lips and you know aloe vera and dryness go hand in hand so i decided to pick it up yeah because i haven't bought a lip balm in forever the last time i owned a lip balm was before covid to be honest not gonna lie there because it's, it's just like you know it's by vaseline so you just expect it to basically look like petroleum jelly just like most lip balms basically and i picked up another maybelline product now the pr the reason i picked up a maybelline product in the that store is because i'd rather uh sometimes when i'm not so sure about the color that i want maybe a lipstick the color that i want or foundation color or the uh setting powder color i just prefer to buy it from a store because that way i can actually see the product and compare it to my skin tone so i did pick up a maybelline as you know i have not owned a fit me powder for a really long time because i've been using the black opal uh setting powder so i decided to pick up a setting powder by maybelline and it's the fit me matte and poreless normal soily skin uh maybelline cappuccino yeah 340 which is cappuccino so that's the one i decided to pick up and unlike the foundation i felt like this one looks more of my skin tone now i am really wondering how to open <laughs> okay it's open so it looks like this as you can see is it looks like it will match my skin you know yeah so i did pick up this one and i'm pretty excited to use it yes it's also more portable than this uh, the black opal is here as you can see this is a setting powder i normally don't have a lot of setting powders a lot of powders i just finish the product then buy another one but as you can see this one is really bulky like carrying it around is i'd rather have this one so that's why i decided to purchase it and i got it from the good life store good life pharmacy and then i got this lipstick that is actually on my lips and do not be fooled i know this is a super stay matte ink i've just applied lip gloss over it i could not wait to use it and i felt like it matched this wig so i decided to use it hurriedly so this is just the maybelline super stay matte ink in the shade 50 which is voyager now i i've seen like jumia doesn't carry a really big variety of shades when it comes to maybelline lipsticks 
uh, and so even good life pharmacy did not have a wide variety of shades but i felt like this one was at least the one that goes with my skin tone right now although it's a bit uh dark for my liking but it's okay it's okay so it's just like a burgundish reddish brown it has like burgundy red brown something of the sort and i really like it. it's like you know super stay lipsticks don't shine so there's gloss on top over here they are just matte so this is gloss in case you're interested in this lipstick it's super super matte and uh yeah i like it so i got it and guys if you're not yet subscribed to this channel what are you waiting as usual for? i normally tell you guys if you're not yet subscribed to this channel i don't know what you're waiting for i don't know whether you're waiting until the end of the days kindly hit the subscribe button i'll truly appreciate it and not only that you'll get my content faster sometimes like youtube wouldn't show you your content if you're not subscribed so make sure you subscribe to this channel don't forget to like don't forget to share comment in the description box anything you're curious about um and look out for a review for this here they said three days <laughs> Should I give the review in three days? Because honestly, they say three days skin will be visibly more even. You know, these companies are now becoming uh, bold. But anyway, we never know. Maybe they have secret formulas. Yeah, so I hope it will work well. And I'm pretty much excited for this. This is my favorite product. I can't wait to use it. Let me wash my face and use it <laughs> today, today. So I'm going to look out for the review of this Garnier Skin Active Even and Matte Vitamin C new is marked here as new yeah booster serum okay thank you so much guys for watching continue being your fabulous self and i'll see you in my next video bye